What's up, LG gang? How are y'all doing this morning? It's 1023. I, okay, I'm out running errands, and y'all know today is Sunday. Sorry if this thing falls. I think I fixed it. Hopefully I fixed it. Um, but anyway, um, I just had something heavy on my heart this morning. Just this morning. Um, I'm on my way, actually, to uh, Starbucks. I have to do a couple of errands prior to laundry here. Um, but I will bag up on my, or not bag up, I will um, tell you what's on my um, mind and on my heart here shortly, but uh, I'm on my way to go get some Acrite juice uh, from Starbucks, get a little breakfast sandwich from there. I'm still stuffy, guys. It's just my allergies, I swear. Um, but, yeah. And then after that, I have to go to the bank to get some funds out. And then I have to go to Dollar General because your girl, we haven't washed, well, we washed last week prior to Vegas. So it's been like two weeks since we haven't washed and we have comforters, we have all this shit, <laughs> all of daddy stuff, because you know he didn't go wash. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry, it's my allergies. All this is my allergies, guys. I swear to God. I already took a COVID test. It's negative. And I took one when I came back. So, boom. Um, but then after that, I'm going to go wash. And after I wash, I have to go to Walmart. So, yeah. I have a full kind of morning. I think I should be done my goal is to be done. Oh, and I got to go wash my car too. So I'll do that after Walmart. Um, but um, I have a full like morning. My goal is to be done like, I need to get over, I think. My goal is to be done probably like at two. Probably even earlier than that. Yeah. But, uh, yes. Um, but let me tell you, uh, what's on my mind and what's on my heart. Like, it is so hard. Not hard. Well, it's hard for me. Kind of difficult for me. Um, as a parent of a 21-year-old now. Because you have to... Well, me, I'm there regardless. Uh, like I always say, right, wrong, or indifferent. Ooh, this has a line, but I don't care. I'm cool with the line. Because um, I don't want to get out. So, um, yeah. But it's 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 kind of, it's challenging. That's, that's the word. It's challenging to direct help and, you know, assist. And, um, you know, guide and all of that when they're adults, you know, because they can ask for your advice all day long, you know, but, you know, it's just really up to them whether or not they want to take heed and listen and all that because most parents that give great advice have been there done that you know and some things work some things didn't so we are here to help and say hey but on the flip note it's also kind of hard when me for instance i have one child well we have one child and we've give 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 gave 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 and of course we had hiccups in the journey of life but who has it you know what i'm saying but my thing is and the principle of it is is that you can't ask for help or guidance or direction when you ain't listening you know what i'm saying so that's where i am now like it's so like crazy like it's so so crazy and i just i want to help and i just want to give it to her and just say, here, here's money, 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 and all that. But there's no lesson learned. You know, there's no lesson learned. You know, so it's hard as a parent 
or for me, it's hard as a parent when I do have it or I can help not to give it to her because generally she's a good kid. Like she's a good, she doesn't get in trouble. She's never been to jail. Like she's never been to juvie. She's never been no police officer or ambulance or nothing like that has had to call me or hospital has had to call me on, you know, something regarding Kelly, you know, so, so it is hard, triple hard (laughs) or double hard to be like, no, when you're really a good kid and you haven't did anything to enforce the no, you know, so I don't know guys. I just, um, pray for your girl. I mean, it's nothing that I can't handle. Like, it's not nothing big. It's just life lessons. You know what I'm saying? And actually, I guess you don't learn until you go through them. Because I didn't really learn until I went through it. And Mike didn't learn until he actually went through it. And and our parents pushed back. So, yeah. That is the update of parent life with a 21-year-old. And... I'm still married, y'all. I ain't got no, no rings on. I feel naked. Uh, well, I got your rings on. But I don't have no rings on because I um, saturated my hair and did like a reboost on my uh, braids. Because this is going to be the last week I have them in. So, that's that. Next week, I don't know. Probably, um, I'll probably do some knotless braids. and not get them too long I think I'm just gonna get them to like right here I don't know cause knotless braids I don't know I might get them a little lengthy like mid back yeah I think I'm gonna do the mid back um on those because uh they're light on this there's no like no tension you know so even with these they look pretty thick you know, they look pretty thick, but there's no, they're the real light. I'm, you know, real, real light. But anyway, y'all, that's my update. I'm in line at uh, Starbucks. The line is not moving. Well, it's moving a little bit. Oh, look at me talking and it's about to move. <laughs> All right. So it is moving. And um, are you going to go, student driver? Yeah. All right. So I'm just going to pull in. Yep. And it doesn't look like it's a student driver. They kid probably the student driver. All right. So, yeah, y'all. So I'm just sitting in Starbucks line about to get some breakfast and coffee. And yeah, I'll dip back in once I am. Well, actually, I'll actually talk to you guys um, once I get back in from putting up my clothes. I'll do some little inserts because you guys have been giving me kudos on my little inserts. So I'm going to do those. Uh, some videos don't have the inserts, but these will have the inserts. So let go. Alright, so I am at, I always have to look, Laundry World. My allergies is okay, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to go to, uh, I always have to watch out for these mother freakers because the laundry mat, it'd be so packed, especially on Sundays, and somebody's, y'all seen somebody hit my shit before, and I was like, oh hell no, so I have to watch out for other cars, but people are pretty respectful in and out type shit so but yeah i just got a phone with kels kind of talked mother daughter talk and stuff i think she i mean she understands what's going on 
and that she sh just has to step into that role, you know? Um, I'm about to put my stuff back in my purse. I'm not gonna go to Walmart. <laughs> I was gonna go get a bulb little thing for my ring light, which I do need to get and all that, but no. I just wanna go home, drink some wine and make me a salad and call it freaking and some hot tea. Ooh, some hot tea sounds really, really good. Some hot tea, y'all. So yeah. But um I am he better hang on to that shit because uh Oh, I'm about to say she better not let her son put that basket, rolly basket, down there because he is going to hit somebody's shit. But anyway, I don't know why I've been cussing y'all. I'm just this is me, okay? This is me. No hold backies. But anyway, um, I was talking to Kells about our trip next month. She is gonna go like probably early no 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 i'm probably gonna get there first thank goodness um whoever's gonna plan on being there be there but i'm getting there monday staying all the way to friday yes ma'am and then kelly will probably go like wednesday thursday friday or tuesday wednesday thursday friday hopefully hopefully she'll spend at least three days and then daddy hopefully he'll get some type of days off which I pro he probably ain't gonna be able to go. I'm just gonna call it like it is. I'm not gonna get my hopes up. If he goes, I'm gonna be like, oh my God. But if he don't, I understand. It is what it is, I'm used to it. But yeah, y'all, I'm at Laundry World now. I'm about to get my clothes out or see what's dry what's and what's not dry. Um, put them all in one, let it spin down, take the rest of my clothes in here. And then yeah, um, I planned on wiping down my car I may I don't know. just because I just got little Kelly leaves trash all up in my car so I am going to pick up just a tad but yeah y'all I'm about to get off because I'm just rambling um, but yeah that is the jish um, and um, I hope hopefully you guys like my little inserty certs um, but guys, I feel like my head is just full of snot, which it is, and I don't feel good. I don't feel, I mean, I feel, I feel great. It's just all this snot in my nose, and it's giving me some sinus pressure and stuff like that, so, yeah. But your girl is good, your girl is good. So, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but yeah. I like this big, big old thing with sour patches. I'm gonna tell myself, don't eat all these with Trey today. Do not eat all these today. Ooh, I might end up dropping some in my wine and see how that, see what that gives me. Just kidding. All right, guys, so like, comment, subscribe. Hope you like videos like this. Until next time, like I always say, peace out.